Hi, this is Melanie with the Lone Star Conference. Thank you for joining us. We're here with Commissioner Stan Wagon as part of the Greyhound and Zia Video Series Week. Stan, each week you've been sharing something unique um, about each school. Give us a little tidbit about Eastern New Mexico. Yeah, Eastern New Mexico has uh, been a Lone Star Conference member since 1984. And uh, probably the unique thing about their membership in our conference is that when they were admitted in 1984, uh, it was the first time that the Lone Star Conference expanded outside the borders of Texas, and so they're the first non-Texas institution in the league. Uh, since then, we've had members in Oklahoma and Arkansas. Uh, currently, we've got uh, members in three states, Texas, New Mexico, and Oklahoma, but uh, that's kind of a unique twist to uh, their membership in our conference is, is that they were the first non-Texas school uh, to be joined. Okay, and the fall is a busy time out at Easter. Give us a preview of what we're going to hear about this week. Yeah, it should be a good week on the uh, video series, learning more about Eastern's fall teams. The, the conference sponsors six sports in the fall, and Eastern New Mexico competes in all six of those, and so they are busy in Portales this time of year. Uh, football team's having an exciting season. Uh, Coach Roboto switched over to a high-powered offensive attack a couple years ago, and so they, they really are a fun team to watch, the way they throw the football around and uh, put up some points on the scoreboard. Uh, they've been doing that again this year. Uh, volleyball, uh, Coach McGuire, Mike McGuire has taken over the helm again, and I uh, uh, know he's uh, having some success this fall. They uh, won a conference match uh, and ended it kind of a lengthy uh, losing skid in the conference and so he's got things kind of turning the corner and looking up for the Zias on the volleyball court. Uh, they've had quite a bit of success in cross country both men's and women's and then on the soccer field maybe is the the surprise story for the conference this year is the men's soccer team at Eastern New Mexico has been nationally ranked uh, each of the last two weeks and having a lot of success in soccer and so Coach Munoz and the, and the Greyhounds uh, are doing quite well this fall. We're, we're kind of excited about uh, seeing how far they can take it uh, as far as the conference race goes then hopefully into the postseason. Alright, thanks Stan. Be sure to check back tomorrow as Greyhound and Zia Week continues.